As parents, our wish has always been that Ellie would meet and fall in love with someone who would always love and protect her. We had no doubt that Liam was the man she would marry. And as we, as we have watched their love grow over the last 14 years, they're a true team. Who could have known, 24 years after being in the same nativity play, the shy but strong-minded donkey, <laughs> an angel would one day marry? Definitely a true love story. I used to think that fairy tales were make-believe. God, already. <laughs> And when Saturday night sleepovers would roll around, 11-year-old Ellie would tell us all about her fairy tale ending when she was full grown. From footsies in French lessons to that little giggle Ellie used to do when Liam walked in a room, we as family and friends have always known we were meant to be together. Liam, <laughs> this is where I should formally welcome you. To the family but as you know you have been part of the family since the day we met you. I couldn't think anyone better to carry on loving and protecting Ellie the way that I have always done. You are perfect for the job. There is no denying how beautiful you look today. I was stunned when you walked around that corner. You're so special you mean the world to me and I couldn't be happy calling you my wife today. I'm so overwhelmed with the love for you and I'm so proud of everything you've done. I love how strong-minded you are and driven you are. I know we share the same things we want out of, this, out of life and I cannot wait to see what the future holds for us. Every day I count myself the luckiest person in the world as you have chosen to spend the rest of your life with me. You are my best friend and the place I call home. So thank you for always supporting me, loving me and believing in me. There is no doubt they're made for each other. Falling in love at such a young age and learning to still love each other as you change and grow as people is an amazing experience. It feels like you've been together for a lifetime. Truth be told, this is just the beginning.